Wealth 922, so we rely on technology to make our lives easier. And nowadays with crowdfunding, there's always uh, a few gadgets on the horizon, yeah, right? Yeah, make life a little bit easier. So today we decided to play one of our favorite games, Love It or Hate It, here on the show with CT Style reporter Megan Yost, who's here to fill us in on some of the upcoming big technologies in the market. Let's, yeah. let's have some fun, Meg. Get your ready. All right, Thank so you. we're going to start with Camerama. So everybody loves the GoPro, but this could be the next big thing. Oh. So you know Google Street View where you can, you know, Spin around house, yeah, and see sure. everything yeah. 360. This is the same concept. So you can do it if you go on vacation and you want to capture that beautiful beach, oh. beach view. Ooh. If you're skydiving and you want to take an aerial shot of you know the scene that you're I seeing. I do that all the time. It's really cool. It shoots in 4K <laughs> and you can actually live stream panoramic videos. Ooh. So and you can also use this with virtual reality goggles, so you can feel relive that vacation that oh, you I loved love so much. How much is it? Uh, well, it's expected to retail for three ninety nine. Three ninety nine. Yeah. Okay. It's not on the market yet. What do you think? Three sixty oh, GoPro oh, action. Who wouldn't love that? That's love incredible. It. I'm love way it. into that. I, yeah, I think really we cool. finally agreed on something for once yeah. here. Love that. <laughs> <it. laughs> All right. Next up, we have the Blink Cam. So this is a device that you can actually capture moments in real time. It connects with any pair of eyeglasses. Huh. It's, it's on the side, and all you have to do is wink or blink. You have to do it in a not so discreet manner, and it'll capture what's in front of you, what you're seeing. Wow. Um, it, it's uh, you can be one of the first to order it on Indiegogo for one fifty nine. So, what do you guys right. think about this? I like it, but what if you accidentally blink, or you have to really? I think you really have, have to. to <laughs> you you, you got to get that motion, yeah. I so hate it's not so. Discreet. Why do you hate really that? Bad. I hate it because think, what if I'm standing in the corner doing the macarena or something I do on a daily basis, and then somebody comes over and they start taking pictures of me? I, I, I want to know. I guess it could be a little. What if you're that sketchy picture? person that's wearing the glasses and you're winking all the time? Right. That's then true. you look no. like a. All creeper. right, I'm indifferent. Yeah. Oh. And if you like having the, you love it. Come on, just admit it. So I'm kind of in between. Therese will be in the studio tomorrow morning, like. Right. And you'll know why on. now. Now I know why. Yeah. Now we know why you're always winking at us. Yeah. Now we know. So next up we have Hudley. Uh, this is if you don't have a high tech car and you want to go hands free, this will actually display what's on your smartphone on your your windshield, oh, so you can see it right cool. in front I of love you. That. You don't have to look away. It'll adjust with the brightness of the day. Um, you, can, you can use your apps hands free. Uh, like you typically would, and um, it's if you're one of Hudley's first 50 backers on Indiegogo, you can get this for 1.99. Nice. What I hope think, this Teresa? one works out. I'm all for it. I, I, it's so important to have two hands on the wheel at all times. That's true. I, I have to agree with you there. But it, is it legal yet? Is, can people use it? I mean, or is it? Still what was illegal about? Yeah. I mean, I mean it, it isn't it's out hands free. Yet. You're not. Right. You're not touching your phone. You're just yeah, using but then, your. But then are people going to say, well, well it's they a actually distraction have this. They have this in cars already, but it's built in. So this is if you don't have that technology. Okay, you guys. You win. can seem like you have a high-end car. All right. Next so one. next up, we have Megasys Horse Runners. This is for the horse lover or ho horse owner. Uh -huh. So say goodbye to those those metal um, horseshoes that oh, you have yeah, to nail oh. or glue into the, Ooh, like the this. hoof. Sure. Okay. This just snaps right onto the horse's hoof. Um, it's shock absorbing. It works with different types of terrains. So if you want to go in the water, up oh. hills, on the dirt. Um, and this is a uh, crowdfunding right now on Kickstarter, and they've raised seventy-seven thousand dollars wow. so far. I think for it's this. a no-brainer. This is great. Yeah. It always looks painful when they're putting the shoes yeah. and trying to remove them from the horse. I don't know if it is or not, but this seems much more civil. Yeah, I like friendly. it. Okay, friendly. Cool. And it's pretty popular, so well, a lot of support. Meg, out there. these are great. We I like it. Yeah. Thank right. you. Thank you. Of course. Good. Can we eat a little bit, Tom? Well, Stroke, it was the, you have some the host. Food for us? Uh, Ooh. Yeah, Look so at that. Wow. Here, Teresa. There you go. Brussels sprouts. Love those. Looks so good. So what is it again? We got. It's Tenderloin from Harvest Wine bit. Bar. Uh -huh. uh, they have locations in Greenwich and in Westport and New Haven. Cooked uh -huh. medium rare by Chef Gus over there. Mm. I think you did a pretty good job. Wow, this is delicious. Are you going to feed it to action. me? Ooh. Mm. Love it. That was not a TV bite, though. <laughs> that was Very a lovely moment right there. Wow. Mm. have to dig into this. Make sure you guys tune in to CT Style. Tomorrow we're going to go uh, mountain bike racing down Powder Ridge, so wish us luck. Bye-bye, everyone. See Bye. you tomorrow. <laughs>